Hey everyone, Mr. Kaczynski here. We're going to start section P of IXL's 8th grade math today, uh, transformations and congruence. So we're going to start off with skill 1, which is F7Z, line symmetry. Quick one today, I think you'll pick up on it rather quick. Is this dotted line a line of symmetry? In other words, if we take this starfish and we fold it over that line, will it match up uh, perfectly? And in this particular one, that's a big yes. Um, it is the exact same on both sides. Now, if even like it had a one dot here that was blue and another dot here that was green, then I think we'd have to say uh, no, based on color it wouldn't be, but black and white it might still be. But in this case, yes. All right, got a slanted one here. And we're trying to figure out if we fold this emerald, or not an emerald, because emeralds are green, uh, over, over that line, is it symmetrical? And best I can tell is that, yes, that is the same on both sides of that line. That's what symmetry means. All right, this wheel um, does have symmetry, but it's not this particular line. In fact, there's, there's a lot of places we could draw a line of symmetry right there is a line of symmetry, right there is a line of symmetry, but the line of symmetry they're giving us, no, that's not a line of symmetry. It's not the same on both sides of it. Uh, this one's interesting because the easel that this artwork is sitting on is probably symmetric across that dotted line, but the actual artwork sitting on it is not. If we fold this over, it's not gonna match, so that one's no. And obviously here again, you know, this hat does have a line of symmetry, you know, right down the middle of it, but the one that they're giving us does not, or is not a line of symmetry. So I think you'll kind of breeze through this. There might be some mistakes you might make, um, but you'll learn from them quick. Good luck. Skill one in section P of IXL's eighth grade math.